Priyanka here. We are discussing sample paper 7. Let's come to question 18. Explain two types of test that Mr. Murthy can use to meet his requirements. Right? So this question is from chapter staffing because only in staffing we done test on the employees. Right? And here you will be given half mark for naming and one and half mark for explanation. So in total 2 plus 2 equals to 4 marks. Now let's go through the case study. Mr. Murthy is the human resource manager of Jai Hind Hospital in Vellore. He has to appoint nurses for the hospital. Since patients in the hospital are of different type. So we get any idea from these lines? Which test? No. Let's move. He wants to find out the candidate's maturity and emotions in dealing with the patients. So number one, what he wants? He wants a mature nurse who can deal with the emotions of the patients, right? And number second, let's move. He also wants to know about the candidate's ability to make decisions. He wants a candidate who can make decisions. So first of all, let's discuss our test. Number one is preliminary test. Number second, selection test. Number third, employment interview. Number four, reference and background check. Number five, selection decision. Number six, medical examination. Number seven, job offer. Number eight, contract of the employee. Right? So these are the tests. Now let's compare one by one. Number one is preliminary test. What it says? It says to eliminate the unqualified persons. Here Mr. Murthy is not talking about elimination. Right? Now second is selection test. There are five tests under this test. Number one is intelligence test. Number second, personality test. Number third, aptitude test. Number four, trade test. And number five is interest test. So let's see, is he talking about selection process? Yes. So we will decide out of these five tests, which test he needs. First of all, he needs a maturity in the person who can deal with the emotions of the patient. So which test? Number one is intelligence test. No, we cannot say that in intelligent, it is not related to each other, right? And number second is personality test. Yes, the personality of the employee can reveal how he can handle the maturity or the emotions of the people, right? So first one is Mr. Murthy needs his personality test. And second one, he needs the person who has ability to take decision. So which person can take decision? Number one is intelligence. Yes, intelligent test. So second one is intelligence. So two types of tests we have identified here. Number one is personality test and number second is intelligence test. So let's see how we will write it in exam. Number one is personality test. It provides clues to a person's emotions, reactions, maturity, value systems, etc. They provoke the overall personality and are different to design and implement. Right? Number second is intelligent test. Intelligence test, it measures the level of intelligence quotient of an individual. It is an indicator of a person's learning ability or the ability to make decisions and judgments. Right? Thank you.